listing the books I have on different areas of self-development um, and just hoping to kind of give you that quick fire information because I know I personally like that going on YouTube and seeing really quick videos of different books that people can recommend. So this week is private practice, so books to read when starting up. Um, and these were the kind of um, ones that I went to that had really good reviews. Um, I've read three of them all the way through. Um, the biggest one I haven't yet read, but they are similar but different and it's just good getting people's different opinions. So the first one is Set Up Therapy Business, a step-by-step -step guide. This one wasn't too in-depth, but what I wanted to do was very good. Um, the next one, this one, is The Business of Therapy. Um, this is more personal, but it has more examples, which I really, really liked, um, of stuff to overcome and how other therapists dealt with it. And I, I really, really enjoyed that because it's so interesting reading other people's thoughts and feelings and how stuff happened and when stuff went wrong and when stuff went right um because you don't really get to hear that kind of stuff so that was my that's definitely my favorite this one's going self-employed so i shouldn't probably put this one in here but that's this did have good reviews and i think with obviously if you're starting up your own private practice you're going self-employed and this one had really good feedback and then the last one like the really quick videos is 12 months to your ideal private practice um, I do believe there was a more recent one to this, um, this is a bit of an older one, but it was quite expensive for the new one. Um, so it's a lot bigger than the rest, if you compare the size of them, you can see it's a lot bigger. I haven't read this one yet, um, it's the next one to go on to. Um, but it does look like she asks questions and kind of you work through it a little bit. Um, so yes, really quick video, private practice, I hope that's helped.